Hello and welcome to Curry Sots episode number 7 and today we're gonna speak about how to save money on food in Denmark so stay tuned So I divided all the available options of saving food in Copenhagen for three different categories first is uh, discount supermarkets and shops Second is uh, special apps, like applications. And the uh, third one is uh, special communities or organizations on which you can kind of save money on food. And let's go to the first category. So first of all, you can always go to the discount supermarkets like uh, Netto, Lidl and uh, the other ones, of course, like uh, I can give you a list in the description. But in Netto, you should always uh, go and check for all the discounts, like for special offers, especially for frozen stuff, you can get stuff like 50% off, which is still good to date, and you can still eat it good. And every day they have a big discounts on uh, fresh. You can buy uh, bakeries, fresh ones, 50% off. So always uh, go there and check in a special cabinet with a sticker which says like 50% off and sometimes it doesn't say but you can always come and ask a person who works there like from which time does it be 50% off and most of the markets uh, must sell the stuff like with lower price moreover like a lot of uh, stores have their own applications where you can also save money by the scanning a code for example for different food or also they just show which stuff is for free they also like available a uh, magazines or uh, websites when you can find it i will put all the stuff like in the description so you can find it like okay and now option number two applications which allows you to save a lot of money and i will start with my favorite one it's called too good to go which allows you to have a food from restaurant in the evening for extremely low price and uh, sometimes it's even a buffet where you can give you a box and you can pick up huge amount of food to fill your box just for like 40 or 30 kronas it's like an amazingly great deal uh, to save some money so i went to the sushi place today and i will show you in details like how to use an app and uh, i will show you the food i got right in a minute so stay tuned so i'll just show you how to do it so we open in the app and then we can see all the deals available from different shops and we need to aim for the ones green green which say like uh, two or three left uh, something we click on one you can see it's tomorrow in the morning so it's a breakfast option so it sound looks great we just read to maybe all the details and uh, then we push buy and then go to the selecting page and basically put our cards and we are good to go so it's like simple as that so all this food I get for only 40 kronas in a sushi place through Too Good To Go app and it was a great deal I think. There's also a huge amount of different other applications is available and I will leave link to them of, uh, in the description for the one I was able to find so uh, hope it will be useful for you. And we move into the option number three and this option about special communities or offers where you can save uh, food a lot and first of them is called uh, food share in Copenhagen which is uh, gathering huge amount of food which is going to be thrown away and giving it to people so they're doing a great job uh, on Facebook or also in other places and I'll leave the link for them so you can also come there and just pick up as much as you need so it's a great deal another maybe more extreme community called dumpster hunting but don't be afraid they're not like digging uh, all the dumpsters for any kind of like leftovers and mainly aiming for the ones which were thrown away right away uh, of supermarket for example they just have some chocolate which was like thrown away uh, by supermarket which is also can still good but they don't they cannot sell it anymore so uh, and they have also a group on facebook where they gather and also share some thoughts or some ideas but also keep in mind that this kind of an illegal because a uh, dumpster is a private property of uh, the supermarket so be careful with that and if you like extreme so you can just try it but I do not recommend it like if uh, you uh, don't want to risk <laughs> another great thing we recently found is a website uh, where you can uh, save a fortune for a candies 
So I just come there and order 20 kilos of different kind of sweets from Sweden for only 500 kronas. And it was already delivered to me by DHL, so I will show you the package and I will show you the app uh, in a minute and also make a review of which time I got, so stay tuned. So we are on the website right now and you can see uh, all these deals for candies right here and you just uh, select one you want to buy like this one and uh, maybe some other one like if you like and then we go to the uh, like our casting and then just order it with GHL and we got it so in a minute I will show you my package which I already received stay tuned so I finally got my package from Sweden it's like 20 kilos and you will see in a minute what's inside Okay guys, I'm finally home, let me show you all this package contains it's like 20 kilos of candy, which cost me 500 kronas, it's basically like 25 kronas per kilo, let's see what's inside. Uh, so we have see all these different things, so just like for chewing, different colors and tastes, and also two of them is like, she can name, Trirgug mix like unpronounceable stuff okay what do we have here oh we have marshmallows one kilo i think it will be a new sleeping pillow for me like it looks great and another one and we got the sweet and sour things i also really like them you know and another one with more colors it's caramel different different tastes like a lot of them so much then what do we have else we have this kind of champs some kind of chewing stuff and again sweet and sour candy oh this big bag of this nice looking marshmallows oh, so cool. and another one yeah what's here and we have uh, another sweet and sour oh this is uh, rod vita scumbola no idea but looks nice and should be taste nice and then uh, this green also candies like marmalade another green marmalade and then a uh, big bag of pin pop strawberry it's also great and maybe the last one yeah i cannot need to open it so i think it's like it's basically a huge amount of stuff and i'm so grateful i found this thing and i have like lifetime supply of candies now for only 500 corners. Yeah. Okay. And the last thing I wanted to tell you is a special startup community which uh, calls Come Eat and my friend Sophie will tell you more about it right in a minute. Hi guys! If you're new to Copenhagen or you just like to socialize, you should check out our startup Come Eat. It's a community for people who like to travel, try new food and make friends from around the world. A Comit dinner is an alternative dinner experience for our community of hosts. They open their homes and invite you to take a seat at their dinner table. Um, it's budget friendly. In Copenhagen, the average price is around 110 crowns per guest, including food and drinks. And for this, you get a non-commercial experience with this homely feeling like hygestemning. There's max maximum guests per dinner, which means everyone is included and no one will feel left out. Um, and then you just can get to enjoy an evening with the nice flow of conversation that you get from sharing a dinner with people from different backgrounds and cultures. It's really cool and you should check it out. Thank you for watching guys. I hope this video was useful for you and you enjoyed it. If you do, please uh, like and share it because sharing is caring, right? And uh, of course, if I forgot something, remember to comment below about the stuff like which you would like to see or which I missed. And uh, I will really appreciate any kind of support from you. And uh, this video didn't have any sponsored commercial. I just do it because I wanted to. <laughs> so uh, have a nice day and see you next time.